I told all you. sounds, all he's sounds. So good with sounds. He's so good with sounds, guys. He'll go like, come on down here, and then <laughs> sounds. sounds. Michael Jackson. <laughs> 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 All the comics that I met, I found him to be the most human. Mm -hmm. What does that mean? But he does sound. Uh, he, yeah. <laughs> I don't get it. How? Uh, because I find ever since it's I. It's called talent, lady. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs>Welcome to the second edition of the live podcast. Yeah, this is the second edition. And look at the Good Night Podcast. Who's here for the first edition? Yes, make some noise. Look at that. So many more people now, huh? Pretty good. You were there too. We remember. Oh, yeah. Wait, Gabe, is this beer or ginger ale? I don't know. Would you... Uh, would you want to ruin I, your Muslimness? I think you put some beer in my ginger nail. <laughs> ginger nails? Ginger anal. Ginger, ginger ale. So, hey. Cheers. Lahaim. Lahaim. All right. Hey guys, cheers Behind. to you. Thank yeah, you so thanks much. Thanks for coming. Wow. We're, uh, we're very happy. Oh, look who's here. My future wife. Your fu oh, Joel, come make your face shown. So Gabriel's getting well, married, Joel. as you guys know. And uh, this is. Uh, he's British, so he doesn't speak great English. Uh, Joel Slavic, everybody. Yeah. Wait, I introduced my wife, and then you brought Joel out. What, I don't yeah. understand. We all know. <laughs> we <laughs> no, all know. I think I just found out. Yeah. No, we're, we're very happy. Uh, can, can that row, can you guys sit closer? Is that cool? Can just move one sofa for, into the front, just so everyone uh, can be in my vision? We have, a, we have a great podcast for you guys. We have a great guest. Yeah, really good guest. Really yes. interesting guest. She's, she's, uh, she's funny. She's real. I was telling her. That's what I like about her. She's a girl. She's no... I know. <laughs> She, she never listened to the podcast. That's why she agreed to be on. <laughs> That's one thing for sure we know. Claire, come on in. Have a seat. Come on, guys, this is uh, Gabriel's future wife. Yeah. This is lovely Claire. This is Claire. Beautiful. Wow. She looks great. Yeah. And next to Claire is the man that's drawing us right yeah. now. Very interesting. My podcast family, right? Yeah. Guys, yeah. my podcast family. Check it out. He's he's got a lot of hits on. Uh, he's done like uh, yeah. stuff for Bobby Lee and stuff. And uh, Joe Rogan. He's gonna he's gonna animate us. This yeah. Is, he's gonna give make me hair. Can you give me hair? <laughs> give me no. <laughs> I don't have the technology for that yet. <laughs> he can't even imagine it. Yeah. <laughs> Ugh, yeah. All right. <laughs> all right. Talking about hair. Oh my God. How can one man be so? There, yeah. yeah. Right. We're doing. <laughs> so again, everything is recorded. Do we, I'm uh, pretty sure. Yeah. Me, okay, you. Can okay, talk. I'll talk. Okay, so I'm I'm very excited to bring out the the guest. The guest, uh, she's a Montreal comic. She has a show called Better Than Your Therapist, where she role plays the role of a therapist. She can't afford one, so she imagines what it is to be a therapist, and then so we'll we'll play that game at the end. If you guys have any troubles in your lives, so we can bring it up and we can uh, discuss it. Does she go to therapy? She doesn't look like it, but uh, <laughs> she's, she's very funny. I'm one of my favorite people in the I city. Yeah. Are you nice. guys warmed up? Did we loop you guys? Yeah, up? yeah? Let's, bring it out. let's bring her out here. Ladies and gentlemen, our guest. Miriam Khan. Miriam Khan, everybody. Yeah. Miriam Khan. Yeah. Hello, Miriam. Come on in. Oh, all right. Oh, oh. Uh, oh, oh. Have a seat, everybody. Oh, guys, oh, thank man. you so much, Miriam. I didn't know you were an actor. Wait, you need to turn on your microphone. Hello? Yeah. <laughs> I should turn it off. <laughs> <laughs> no, I okay. didn't. I didn't know you're an actor. I'm your favorite person in the city. In Montreal. My in Montreal. Second, my oh, second favorite city. female in the city. Wow. Comedian, yeah. First one's <laughs> None of the females uh, approve of that comment, and I approve of them. This is disgusting, game. What is wrong? <laughs> you put beer in my gin. No, dude, you, this is what he, Amber does before, before every show. He chugs two different types of sodas at the same time, <laughs> and then does chin-ups for approximately five minutes before every show. Yeah. Even if it's like a show with, without a chin-up bar, we're just lucky. He, he just finds someone's strong yeah, arms. Pumping, I started working out, bro. Sure. Yeah, you, 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 you lost weight and I, I gained did. weight so I'm like it's like girls who like feminine men yeah go for you and girls who like bears but I'm here for me. I'm hella hairy though I know but you're like a feminine bear yeah you're like a teddy bear I'm like a cancerous I'm a, bear I'm a bear <laughs> yeah I'm like a can before the, the I have like, thick nipples though speak with our guests oh yeah <laughs> no it's just fun watching you two do a podcast <laughs> <laughs> just here to watch damn oh. I have big thick nipples <laughs> I don't know how we got into this, but uh, sure. Round of applause for Gabe's nipples. Yeah, hey. 
Sometimes I take like videos of myself from the bottom up, and then I look at my, and I'm like, hey, I look pretty good. And then I, and then I just see like it. You don't even see my gut. You just see my nipples at a certain point. Are you like very body conscious? Yes, I'm very insecure about my body. You, you do talk you're about it a right? lot. Of- I'm not a therapist, but I've been to therapy. So <laughs> she's basically quite I can role people. play as a therapist. <laughs> okay, is, the, is, the, is the audio good? Can you guys hear us well? Yeah, perfect. Okay, is sorry. it a little what? A little loud? Who's loud? Me. <laughs> How about we speak a little bit? Miriam is always loud. It has nothing to do with the mic. <laughs> yeah, but we need the capture. I know, you need to capture. Okay. Oh, this is better. Yeah. This is better. Okay, yeah, so I'll just talk perfect. like, yeah. is this good? So, Amber, how are your nipples? My nipples are, I don't really pay attention. Nobody wants to hear this nipple talk, I guess. I could tell by the face. Oh, oh we have a fan of nipples. Uh, oh, really? All right. Oh, she, she, she's the lifeguard at the YMCA that I always walk by. Yeah. 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 So Give it up guys, to YMCA. If you guys are drowning in laughter, <laughs> she'll I'm save on. you. Yeah. All right. You I'm saw sorry. me at my fattest getting down slowly. Does he float less? No, I don't swim. I just walk by the pool. There's like there's like a window where And you every- just watch? <laughs> no, I feel like I'm being watched by all these old ladies and like doing like yo- water yoga. What is it? I don't even know. Water is that a thing? Okay. <laughs> water yoga? And what are you doing? <laughs> Aerobics. Aerobics, yeah. Yeah, so water. Mario, we tell me. like to start the podcast, but how was your week? Did you do anything fun or exciting this week? Not really. I. Uh, what day is it? Great today? podcasting, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> no, I've done some wild things, but I'm not yeah? going to talk about that. How many oh. days a week do you go to therapy? I don't go to therapy anymore. I actually fired my therapist. That's a it was a very dram- no. It was a very dramatic story. She's chasing me yeah. now. That's a very Tony Soprano thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. I. I had to I had to fire her. What? Okay. Yeah, she was very inappropriate and I let her know that the therapeutic relationship has been broken and cannot be but repaired. But the sexual relationship just began. No, the she's therapy? done. She's done. What happened? Uh basically I was crying mid-session. I was like getting very emotional, which I don't tend to do, and if I do, I pretend it never happened. And then she called you gay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I just pretend it doesn't happen. But I was, I was getting really emotional and I was like talking about money and like where I am in my life and stuff. And she just looks at me stern face and she goes, I did not receive last week's payment. I know. And the thing is, the week before there was this crazy snowstorm that was like wild. And she has a policy, which makes sense. You cancel 24 hours in advance. The morning of, I was like, can we get on the phone? Can we do a Zoom call? She's like, no, I'm going to be in the office. I'm like, in order for me to get to you, I'm going to die. Mm -hmm. So I can't make it. And uh, she still held the policy. And I was like crying. And I was like, can we make an exception? She takes the longest pause. And she goes to me, there are no exceptions. Yeah. She had very strong boundaries. And I was like, we're done. How right there, right then? You yeah, probably- I never saw her again. And now she's chasing me. She's like, can we talk about it? I'm like, I'll charge you. Oh. Uh, no, I, I just, yeah, yeah. Uh, but- Woo! Yes, queen. Ah. Yes, yes, yeah, yes, yes. No, no, honestly. Who the world? Jews. All right, sorry. <laughs> I'm going to bring down Miriam's uh, mic a bit. Sorry? Yeah, bring she's going to bring it down. Yeah, yeah no, three yeah, and a half years, women. we're done. Oh. Three and a half years, we're done. Three and a half years. And was I was that consistent. Was relationship? Yes, actually it was. Wow. I'm sorry to hear this. Did, did you know no, I'm not sorry. Are you looking for a replacement? No, I, I feel, honestly, I've been feeling good, you know? It's like the same issues that keep reoccurring. At a certain point, you're healed. You're like, you know what? I was like trying to come up with material. Like I literally look at her in session and be like, okay, so do I keep talking about my mom? Like, what are we doing here? So the crying the last time you saw her was for fun or? Because you were- It was just for old time's sake. It was for old time's sake. Because crying in front of someone, I don't know, will require a lot. Yeah, Yeah, but you know what? It's like things, it's like, we know this. Like, what are we going to do about it? You know? And then, but it was like the fact that she turned it into like, she was thinking about her bag. You know, she was thinking about her money, and I was like, "Oh yeah, we're done, mm. right?" Yeah. She how how was she as a therapist before this incident occurred? What do you mean how? You know what? She was not bad, but I definitely was a good client. You know, like I made her money worth it. Like, 
How much? Can you recommend her to me, please? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> How much is a therapist? How much does that cost? Like, yeah, I'm it's curious. like one thirty. What an hour? Yeah, forty-five hour? minutes for forty-five minutes. What? Who makes more than one hundred and thirty dollars? No one. Look at the, all these broken. I know. The they're fuckers. disgusted by me. We need rich people to. We need therapists. What? Just, I know. I, can you believe it? She's still. So I gave her the money the next day, and I was like, "Don't ever talk to me again." No, I just gave her the next day. Uh, gave her the money the next day, and I was like, "Yeah, the therapeutic relationship is done." But what We're if? Done. Look, but you said it was done. Why did you have to give her the money? Can't you just be like, "Listen." Yeah, no more because money. like then that's lingering, you know. Uh, yeah, she wanted. I was like, "Take it and leave yeah. it." She's like it's like a divorce. You just, yeah, yeah, just give it yeah. and be gone. That's like, really the house. I don't care. Shish that, that's yeah. a really, that's a really good insight. That's some good therapy from on her end. Is this? <laughs> yeah, she showed me how to make money. Did you decide to start your show better than a therapist? <gasps> better than your therapist. Than oh. Your therapist after. No, it was before, but I think because she saw the advertising, ah. I think she knew, right? Like. She's like, wow. she, and I never brought it up in therapy either. What, you're stealing. Oh, welcome, guys. Come. Have a seat. Have a seat. Welcome. Alessandro, everybody. Hello. Hi. Yeah. He's snapping his welcome. fingers for me. Sorry, Owner you, of. You brought the goods? Yeah. Awesome. Hey, Joel, can you put them in the fridge? The Perfect. Fridge. The, the, there's a beer fridge behind you if you want. Perfect. We got some sweets, Woo. guys, by uh, Alessandro, our chef. Oh, you're the Delicious best. Delicious sweets. I literally got it. I'm not going to say who, but someone messaged me. Earlier today, saying, "Oh, I'm looking forward for the cannolis." Me too. <laughs> and then I said, "We're not bringing cannolis." And then sh they got sad. I don't want to say what gender it is of uh -huh. the person. And then they got sad. Then I said, "Then I was driving, messaging Alessandro, please make cannolis and bring them <laughs> because she because they wanted <laughs> cannolis." <laughs> You're such an ally, dude. It's yeah, great. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> ah. <laughs> what about you, Gabe? Did you have a fun week? Oh! But oh, wait, you don't oh, want yeah. to share? You said you had a spicy week, but... Yeah! Oh, I share, can't talk share. about that. Everybody, really? share, 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 share. No. Uh. <laughs> no, it was crazy, but oh, I can't okay. talk about it. Did it involve, like, a lover? Maybe. A stranger? Stranger. And maybe a stranger. A strange lover? A lover and a stranger. A lover and a stranger. <laughs> Whoa! <Wow. laughs> Maybe, She's getting wild. Maybe she needs to go back to therapy. No? Yeah, I do. I really <laughs> am not well, but I am fun now. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, you see, I'm bringing No one's supporting me. Don't ask what's in her cup, guys. It's, yeah, it's water. It's medication. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Nice. What about you, Gabe? Did you have any... Yes, I went far away. I went camping, and I uh, uh, went camping around a bunch of uh, Quebecois people. Ooh. Completely Quebecois, no English allowed. <laughs> it's, it's not that funny. You know? <laughs> it was very, it was very scary for me. I'm reading, so I finished this book recently, on the. Uh, it was about the troubles in during Ireland with the IRA uh, attacking. Oh, you're like, educated. Nah, no, no. The story I'm about to tell you, I'm going to see. <laughs> like, is this or maybe you're like, I wanted to be inspired by a diet. I, just, I love the fact that. IRA terrorists and just normal Quebecers <laughs> yeah, good. elicit the same feeling in, in Gabriel's Sorry. heart. <laughs> like, so, ah! So, so they speak a different language. So I, I don't know French at all. Like, I don't know any French. I'm very, very little amount of French. I know, like, bonjour and uh, je veux in... <laughs> Je veux an amour? Is that uh, I want an amour? Is that how? Yeah, yeah. Just said, I want a bitter. I want a Oh, okay. My name is, means bitter. Je ah, veux an je, uh, give me some more French words. Or words. Okay, how about let's play a game. You say a word and I'll say it in French. Putain. Oh. Is that like... Uh, it's a hua. Oh, that's interesting. What does putain mean in French? Isn't that... Isn't that oh, wait, isn't that just French for Miriam? <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking, I'm joking. Maybe, oh, come on. Maybe after this spicy... <laughs> oh. <laughs> They're my fans. <laughs> oh, Gabe, fuck. <laughs> There's like 70% women I know. in the audience. I know. I'm just, uh, we're having, I think I'm having fun. Uh, <laughs> oh, grapefruit. Grapefruit. Poos. Pamplemousse. Yes. yes. <laughs> Pamplemousse. Yes. So you're a liar. You, you speak got French. Them back. <laughs> <laughs> you called Miriam a whore. <laughs> you said Pamplemousse. Oh, I thought, I again. thought yeah, no, Pitain no, was fine. like orange or something. Or oh, Pitain, Pitain. I know. <laughs> France? Yeah, Pitain. Uh, in, fr in Quebecois, it would be salope. salope. Oh, I'm damn. Salope. Mariam, have you heard? Have you ever heard of the Quebecois? Oh, yeah, your ex was Quebecois. No, he wasn't. He? That's a lie. Oh. 
<laughs> he wasn't real. It was like a cow in the audience. Like, oh. Yeah, that's how I feel. Because I always found like Quebecois dirty talk is. Oh, I dirty. can't. I can't. Oh, I see my Yeah, I can't, I can't be attracted to that. Ugh. That turns you on. You seem like you're turned on by that. No, no, not Quebecois. I, I can't dirty talk in French. Like participe, passe, and. Yeah. Mixed up. The feminine masculine must be up too. Well, usually yeah. they're. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like Literally. pretending to know what you guys are saying. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> you just make noises. I feel. So yeah, I, I do. <laughs> I know. That's what I do. It's like your act. Also, I, I also. did a show with Gabe, and literally the host goes, "Guys, your next comic." He was bringing up your next comic. He has a podcast with the, the guy you saw before. You know the one who just makes sounds. <laughs> yeah. Because <laughs> I think twenty percent of Gabe's punchlines are man. <laughs> Yeah, not bad. You have a couple of woofs in there. <laughs> yeah, couple oh, yeah. Of meows, couple like, of woofs. Yeah. So I was I was in Quebec. I was deep in Quebec, and I was I, was, I just finished this book on the IRA. Uh, I was like terrified of like I, I thought for some reason there was a bigger divide in Quebec than there actually was because I thought in my head we were in. 1970s Ireland for okay, some so reason. Okay, so you were also on mushrooms. No, I'm just like deeply <laughs> paranoid. Yeah, I'm very, very paranoid. And so we were dancing, me and Claire, we were dancing in, in like... the forest? <laughs> <laughs> there was like a, like a little, there was like a big room with like was a band. Like, was, there, was there like girls wearing flowers in her hair and there was a cliff? And it was <laughs> it's like a cult? And they're like... <laughs> <laughs> Spooky. <laughs> Come on, you guys saw Midsummer? Midsummer? <laughs> You're in a hostel. People are going to think we're speaking German or whatever. Yeah. They're like, did someone call my name? <laughs> I told all you. All sounds. All He's sounds. So good with sounds. He's so good with sounds, guys. Who so, needs punchlines? I know. So, Claire, we were dancing, right? And I, oh, wait, where were you dancing? It was like a there was a band in a big room. It was like a new room, and it's like they had like a, a reception area, and there was like, oh, so we were like, oh, let's go dancing, because they had like, th there was like, uh, it felt like, you guys would watch the show Fallout, where there's like announcements and stuff, and it's like, we have, in French, I, I had to translate, I was like, we have a 9.30 p.m. Uh, dance, dance a song, we're going to have a lot of fun, bring bring your ladies down, boogie down here. Okay, your fears now seem legitimate, mm -hmm. like, I'd be freaking <laughs> out like, too. It would go like, <laughs> come on down here, and then, <laughs> <laughs> sounds. Sounds. <laughs> So we go down. I hear Michael Jackson. <laughs> Damn, you guys are right. <laughs> and we're like, oh, we're going to dance our asses off. What we see is approximately 48 to like 60 middle-aged women line dancing to Billie oh Jean. Oh, my. It was like line God. dancing. Did you take videos? Like Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god! I in that moment I thought, no, I gave Stacey a woman. You must have been so hard. Right? No, oh my god. No, 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 no. What? what? Sixty? You're like, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, I, that's how. Yeah, yeah. No. What's wrong with forty? <laughs> no, no. That, oh. oh, nothing. Oh, yeah. Before no You're old, sorry. Yeah. No, no, no. When I say forty to sixty, I mean the number of women. Oh, oh. It was forty. It was like a packed room filled with women line dancing. You know, like you guys know if you look for that French. Yeah, yeah. Dance, right? I had to do that in elementary school. Why did you have to do that? Because I went to like the most white, like elementary oh. school of life. I it was the first. You know, we live in Quebec. <laughs> I know to exist here. It was very yeah, I know, fun. but I know the culture. <laughs> is my point. But it was Billy Jean, man. I didn't make any sense. And I... Billy Jean. <laughs> 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 okay, to Quebec is it? Okay, <laughs> Billy <laughs> Jean <laughs> est pas mon amour. <laughs> So I, w I was afraid to dance normally because I thought they would look at me and see that I was not part of their French group. And, and in my head, I thought, okay, IRA, the 1970s, blowing up a bomb. And I was... Wait, no you thought joke. they were going to blow you up? No joke. I the Irish lyrical. Uh, the, uh, uh, jig. Yeah. The jig? No. It? I, it was, uh, no. River it, dance. River dance, yeah. High La line. danse du fleuve. <laughs> is that is that accurate? <laughs> okay. I'm, I'm making my the three Quebecois <laughs> people not feel excluded in this. Oh man, that really killed the energy. I'm sorry. Keep the story going. No, no. no. <laughs> and so make like, it sound quick. <laughs> <laughs> All right, sorry. So Claire started dancing normally, and in my head, I, I I went into full panic mode. Right? I was like, Claire, what are you doing? People are gonna think you're on cocaine. <laughs> 
And she's like, I'm just dancing normally, like dancing like this. And I was like in the corner, terrified, because I because they were line dancing, and I swear to God, I thought they were gonna see us and then go to our car and slash our tires and br- and out because of this whole book. So what happens at the no, end no, of the book? Wait, sorry, don't blame the book. I've known you for ten years. You're terrified. The book. The book. <laughs> You're terrified of French Canadian. Right? I am. <laughs> that is it's weird. Like I know. He meets a Guillaume. He's like, oh no. Is it because you don't speak French? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> How, wait, did you grow up here? He yes. was born here. <laughs> How do you not speak French? Park I don't X? know. It's Park X. I grew up in a, in an insular bubble. I'm basically. So a, you speak Hindi. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You speak Punjabi. Punjabi. Yeah. <laughs> Salakuta, you. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Tiri Mandi. Again, it still sounds. Desi <laughs> Mandi. I love Desi Mandi. I Five love Desi Mandi. Five dollar fish. What's the song? Kuda. Oh, uh, one pound fish. Your uncle? You recognize him in London? One pound fish. <laughs> oh, jeez, this is Come bad. Come on, you guys know one pound fish? You guys don't know very, one very pound fish? No, we don't. Very, very good. <laughs> one pound fish. Wait, wait, I, I love that. I love fish. Uh, but yeah, no. So yeah, I was terrified. So you're afraid of French Canadians. They didn't he kill you. He is awesome, though. We were in London together in, my, in a very safe place. <laughs> Surrounded by, <laughs> by Brit- white <laughs> British Anglos. <laughs> Surrounded by British yeah. Anglophone speaking. He loves Quebec. Yeah, yeah. I <laughs> had <laughs> the most fun with Guillaume one night. We got really drunk and danced mm. all Where night. Where was I? I didn't go with you. I don't remember. Oh, you were on a date. Oh, yes. He goes on vacation. Anyway. <laughs> this guy goes, we go on vacation. He's like, I got a date. <laughs> He's like, I got a date. Was this with a cop? Yeah. H- how did you meet the cop? On, on Hinge. Okay. Yeah. But you ended up having a long distance relationship. Yeah. For how long? A couple of years. Couple of years? Yeah, give or take, I think. Right? No, that's a big deal. A year and a half. A year yeah, and a half. Probably, I, yeah. Okay. And uh, were you loyal this whole time? Yeah. Okay. And how often would you see each other? Every day, we'd like FaceTime. No, but like physically. Uh, so I saw her in the summer, then I saw her in October. Okay, it's a quarterly thing. After. Summer, that's... Actually, no, it was less... Okay, then it was a year. It was way less than two years. Sorry. So, but she never visited you here. Yeah, she came to, she came to Montreal. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, he mm-hmm. met her. Yeah, yeah. Can yeah. I ask why I broke up? <laughs> she lives in London. I live here. <laughs> yeah, I know, but you never wanted to make the move? It's not that easy to move to London. Why not? It's not that She's easy. a cop. Yeah. She'll protect you. <laughs> I'm not fearing for my life. Do you think? Yeah, but I'm she'll probably know life? the ways to get there, you know? I still have to emigrate and leave yeah, everything. Yeah, but London is amazing, no? And rent in London is not Yeah, cheap. but you live with her. Yeah, but no. I, <laughs> she makes a lot of good points. He man. doesn't That's believe good. in love. <laughs> okay. No, I feel like there's something else that happened and you don't want to share to the group. No. You said I'm real. Let's. I want Ammer to be real tonight. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we need Ammer to open. Oh. Let's go. We need Ammer to no, open. I'm uh, scared. I'm scared about. I don't want to. Ammer, have you ever had your heart broken? Oh, I feel like you oh. act like you don't. Have I had my heart broken? Yeah. Yeah. Every breakup, whether I initiated or the girl does, and you get devastated. Oh, 100 percent. You're capable of that. <laughs> Completely. Yes, I have feelings. Do you cry? <laughs> I cry. Okay. Not in front of strangers, but I yeah, cry. I do. Yeah. <laughs> Apparently, when I go through it, she I'm, does, guys. I know. I once did cry in front of Amr, but yeah, we're not going to talk about oh, really? that. Really? She's like, no, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, it's okay. No, no, no. We don't need to force tears. I. Uh, sound <laughs> yeah, sound effects. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> It sounds like a puppy. I don't know. <laughs> this is the same thing going comes. through. Isn't that funny? Wow. It sounds like someone's going to love you unconditionally. <laughs> <laughs> this is the greatest right love here. of it. No, but do you feel like yours is the greatest love? You two? How did no. you two fall in love? Oh, fall in love? I don't know. We're, we're, like, how we're did loved. this two happen? We, we were together for many years. No, uh, <laughs> we used to go, we, we did like really shitty open mics together and, so I, remember, many and I would get like drunk. Like which ones? McLean's. Remember McLean's? McLean's? Yeah, 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 yeah. So you guys Rumpy. were all, and you would look, you found love in a hopeless place. Richard yeah. Mullen. I, oh. oh no, no. You don't even, you don't even, you don't even want to know. The worst shit ever. Out of all the comics that I met, I found him to be the most human. Mm-hmm. What does that mean? But he does sound. Uh, he, yeah. <laughs> I don't get it. How? Uh, because I find ever since I... It's called that, talent, lady. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he, there's a, in show business, I find there's a lot of people who are like sociopaths. 
Ja. And uh, some people hide it way better than the others. I've always been blessed in being able to detect sociopathy in people. So there's a lot of people that, I'm, that terrify me because I'm like, oh, I can tell exactly what you're doing. But he's like, there's yeah. no. I, I can't hide it. But how do you know? Okay, but how do you discern? How do you discern? <laughs> like, this I can't hide it. Like, the outer sounds. sounds. On stage is this. I can't. I can't hide it. Ta, 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 ta. Can you get home? That's it. Is that his voicemail? That's all he is. 24-7. I love it. How can I not love him? That's the French are coming. <laughs> yeah, no, that's amazing. And what was it about Amr that you also felt he similar really, affection? I really say the N-word. He's like, he's uh, yeah, yeah. my best friend forever. Amr drove me home a lot. It was <laughs> <laughs> Is that simple with you, huh? No, it's true. I used to, because he, he lives not far from my house. Yeah. And we'd be in my car and we'd develop. Like, yeah, we spoke a lot. I, I, I always liked him. Mm -hmm. I always right. Liked him. Yeah. But and then when did it turn into a love? Uh, I don't know. I, I would say know. that when we went to London, yeah. I really like I discovered. A, the you traveled well. That's important. We traveled well. We get drunk well too. Yes, ah. yes, Because yes. I, I barely drink. Yes. Except when he spikes. And it's just the oil. sex is <laughs> consensual when you're drunk. And then we got drunk, and he's just I can count on him. Yeah. And, and hoping yeah. he can count on me. Yeah, I can, we can count on each other. Yeah. Are we almost getting emotional? Like, what's happening? Cry, cry, don't, don't cry. cry. <laughs> cry. <laughs> yeah. That's amazing. Yeah, and we both paint One our day toenails. You have a best friend. Don't worry. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I do. John Kotrakwas. No, he's John, our best friend. John, John, John is my husband. He's everyone's best friend. Yeah. Guy, no, John no, yeah, we so have a special. He is very lovable. He's so yeah, he's great. You guys, you know John Kotrakoy? He's in a yeah, very talented he's comedian. Very talented comedian, yeah. Yeah, but like he's also abusive behind the scene, but it's okay. Well, he's still, like, <laughs> even though he's a gay man, he's still a Greek man. So he, at saying? the end of the day, <laughs> he's still. That's Greek. a good way to yeah. put it. Definitely more abusive than you. Like this guy, you're you're like a Greek woman next to him. Yeah, sure. I uh, <laughs> I, I, I made I, I said I was hanging out with a, a gay man and we were talking about hot guys. I, I know I'm straight, you should know, but I like mm -hmm. beautiful men. Mm -hmm. Anyone else? We have straight men here. Do you guys like look at a man, you're like, that's a beautiful man. Yeah. Yes, thank yes. you. Thank you. Is that how you feel about me? So anyway, so we're talking, <laughs> I was talking to this gay man, I was showing him a photo of Jude Law, and he's like, oh, he's fine. Yeah, oh, and I remember that. Yeah, I remember Jude, that. Yeah, that, that was Law. bullshit. Yeah. yeah, he was hot. I'm like, I'm sorry, you're not gay. I'm like, <laughs> he's like, I'm gay. I'm like, you're not gay. If you don't find Jude Law hot, you're straight. Well, what was his type? I don't know. Asian? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, then you're not going to find Jude Law hot. How can you not find, uh, who here finds <laughs> Jude Law? Young Jude Law. Yeah, he's good. Do these people uh -huh. even know Jude Law? They're so young. See, the she doesn't know Jude Law. The talented Mr. Ripley? He's fucking, it was a great movie. Oh my god, tanned. Closer. He looked good and closer. He looks Alfie. Gattaca. Alfie. Uh, he looked good. Uh, your thing. I don't like feet on tables. Gattaca. Wow, look at him. Oh yeah, I love Gattaca. Gattaca yeah. was good. Gattaca. Yeah. But wow, we're aging ourselves. Ethan we need to stop. Hawk. Yeah, I know. Ethan Hawke. Yeah, he's good. Back in the so day, oh I know. You know who I'm really into? Benicio del Toro. Oh, that man, I, any day, any, he could do whatever he, he wants. He can Benicio del Toro, that's asshole. I'm telling yeah, you, let me tell you something. <laughs> he could. I'm mm, you are? Okay. I'm yeah. not gay, but I find beautiful men way Well, you are right. Lebanese at the end of the day. I am. That's, <laughs> yeah. that's, 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 <laughs> that is. We are the gayest Arabs. I'll give you this. Yeah, yeah. You are <laughs> Lebanese. You're on the spectrum. <laughs> You're fluid on a spectrum. Let, let, let me think. Have I ever had a gay experience? You definitely yeah, had a gay dream. You've yeah. definitely... No, we never. Okay. No, <laughs> yeah. no, no, no. That's, know, Keon, yeah. that's my best friend. That's my childhood best friend. If oh, I... I've heard about you on set. Like on... Isn't he hot? He's a good looking man. He's a good looking man. <laughs> He's just but Is that duplex. his wife? Girlfriend? Yeah. Just she's also place. gorgeous she's gorgeous mashallah I'm very happy for him but you know you he's not looking at you at all well, <laughs> it's all about Guillaume and the storylines too I love the fact she you, you miss she grabbed his thigh yeah yeah establish. she's like Guillaume this like, is mine Amherst? bitch this Stay is mine <laughs> listen Maryam go back to your therapist <laughs> This I'm very damaged. I am a, I'm a very damaged person. He doesn't person. like attention. Let's just stop talking about him right now. He likes to be in the shadows. Okay. But uh, have I ever had a gay experience? I kissed a guy once, but he... You forced, did? He forced himself on me. Yeah. And how long did it last? Two guys? Uh, two weeks. No. <laughs> 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 no. One of them is a joke. It's like Eugene, my best friend. He just he took me he's like... Mwah. And That's not a kiss. Time, it was a bartender. He saw me talking to two models, two African models, like six feet tall, 
dark skin. I'm like, oh my god, you guys look like hot extraterrestrials. So I'm making them Extra- laugh. Oh my god, the you did not say was that. Try- he was not working. He was trying to like. Did you just call them extraterrestrial? Yeah. Listen, some <laughs> hot people they don't look from Earth. Ah, uh, okay. You yeah, agree yeah. with me? You look, you look like that's what I call French people. Like. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay so there were two hot women yeah, and i'm talking to the next man, level and, and the guy did not like he felt threatened because i was making them laugh so he took me he's like, Mwah. i'm like what the hell he's like eh, but tongue funny. Like, that's funny. Not funny <laughs> no but tongue no 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 tongue. Nah, just, just a like, kiss Mwah. okay that's not like gay no <laughs> <laughs> what sounds are gonna come out of him now hi <laughs> papi a, a lesbian no. Never? Never. Never. Not you never little? had a lesbian experience. Not no, even. a female comedian, no lesbian experience. Seriously? Wow. Maybe. Well, <laughs> I'm surprised. G- Gabe, have you ever kissed? Remember Thanos? Yeah. Kissed him. You kissed him? Yeah. Oh, on stage. Yeah, on stage. On stage I doesn't count. count. Yeah, yeah. On stage, I flirted yeah. with more men than every other <laughs> yeah, I know, me too. <laughs> it's so stupid. I know, no. That, on stage doesn't count. For, for comedy effect, you can suck a cock. <laughs> Actually, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's like smoking a cigarette. It doesn't count. Yeah, it doesn't yeah, count. yeah. So Mary, we never had because maybe we're, we're, I'm a very private person. <sighs> That's good. I know it's not fun. It's not fun. We're getting ca- like we're being videotaped. We should replace her. This is. I know, right? Yeah. I'm sorry. Uh, you think? Okay, right. maybe, maybe. Maybe. Just say yes or no. You don't have to say who. I can't. I made out with a girl. You made out with a girl. Yeah. Do we know her? Is she? No, no, no. Oh, okay. How old were you? How old was I? Yeah. Well, she was like a good eight years younger. Okay. And They're always younger. And I was 18. No. <laughs> no. No, but I mean, it was like a drunken night. <laughs> yeah. What are you saying? I don't want to do it, Auntie. <laughs> auntie. Oh, oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, baby. Woo. Listen, you're I'm, triggering some memories for some. <laughs> yeah, I know. Oh. Our this is her therapy. She's like overcompensating by wearing smiley faces. <laughs> I know. <laughs> nice. How long did that last? The making out. I don't know. I was super drunk. It was just like um, maybe like a minute or something. Oh, that's a that's a proper, <laughs> that's a, oh, that's wow, a proper that's guess. Tongue? Huh? Tongue? Of course. Yeah, yeah there was tongue. No, no, no. Whew. Okay, first base. Okay. It was just a kiss. Yeah, that's, 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 that's not much. How old were you? You said you were? I was like, this was like maybe like 10 years ago. Okay, mm-hmm. so you were 40. <laughs> I was uh, I was 52 when that happened. <laughs> yeah, okay. 30, <laughs> still 30 is an old age to experience. Listen. Is it? Is it? Yeah, so. Thank you. He's hard. I can't. <laughs> yeah. I no, I mean, <laughs> on a, yeah, but the thing is. Like, I don't live like normal people, I feel. Uh Sorry? I don't live like normal people, I feel. Like, you know, I'm doing stand-up. Like, uh, what are we doing? This Mm -hmm. is not adult life. This is child play. I know, this is really stupid. This is really stupid. What are we doing? Let's just stop and reflect. What are we doing right now? What are we doing with our lives? No, we're we're entertaining. But my point is that, like, (laughs) I can't expect to live normally when everything else is so abnormal. I mean, listen, everybody has an excuse to be gay. (laughs) All right. By the way, <laughs> 10 years ago, she wasn't a comedian. That's the funny part. Yeah. No, it wasn't 10 years ago. W- was it? Yeah, maybe like I'll get seven, seven, eight years seven ago. Seven years ago, okay. Cool. Yeah. I, it's funny that you say it's true. We don't have a regular life. We don't. I. Uh, you, you guys wash your clothes? Yeah, make some noise if you Uh-oh. wash your, your clothes. Dry clean only. I, I'm happy we have, a, we have a lady here. We can, you know, get her professional input. But uh, I, wow. <laughs> I, wow. I wash my clothes. And I roll this like, you know when you put it, then you go like wash, and the machine is like wow, 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 I have a good machine, yeah. so mine doesn't do that. Mine does wow, wow, wow. And it's like, like, from now on, I'm washing everything By gentle. hand? Like, no, gentle. Okay. Because this is work. I'm working right now. This shirt, this is as dirty as ever it's going to get. Why am I wow, 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 wow. Oh, it's true. You don't need to. Yeah, like, but you sweat, you're like and you're gross. The yeah, but the gentle. You're gross. He's not. It, there's air conditioning It's 42 here. degrees outside. Yeah, I know, but you don't need wow, yeah, wow. Yeah, you sure. do. It's gentle. Gentle doesn't. No, she's right. Gentle he's, is, no, he's you're right. You're gross. Yeah, I think. Don't ever admit that in public again. Why? Gentle is true. That's am the I, worst thing crazy? you could ever admit to. I, I'm not soaking. Why are you being so vulnerable? It's enough. I don't know. No, I think guys, everyone here. You're, you're, why no are you? No one s- except him. He's a chef. Everyone here yeah. has never touched a hammer in their life. What? Has no idea. Oh, I'm sorry. 
Okay. I love it. If you do, then yeah, you use the regular setting. But look, look at this guy's an engineer. He's very. You uh, don't need gentle. Gentle is enough. Trust me. Gentle is enough. This is a really controversial I love subject. It. I love it. I talk about jizz and Jews for 40 minutes. Yeah. I bring a wash and clothes. People are like, fucking, <laughs> fuck, how dare he? It's 2024, okay? We don't like the I just like the idea. gender I, talk. I know. I like the idea of like putting my laundry, it's like regular. Super! I just feel like my clothes are going to become better or what something. What sound does it make when it's super? <laughs> oh, it's shifting. Gears. It's my microwave. <laughs> All right. I, okay. I, I had the most interesting weekend ever. I, that's true. I, mm. I rarely bring up this. Okay. So as you guys know, I don't go out much. I'm not a mm. guy who go out. So, so on Saturday, I went for a walk. And when I'm walking, I hear someone go, hey, Amr. Mm. And I turn and I recognize that guy. He's a, he's a guy who came to a show once. We started following each other on, on Instagram. And uh, he's like, oh, you know. Wait, is this a fan? Yeah. Oh. And we became like, you know, like acquaintances. We just follow each other on Instagram. And the guy's like, hey, I'm with my friend. We're going to go have a beer. Do you want to come? You stalked your fan. No, he <laughs> came to me. Oh, yeah. Okay. He came to me and he's like, hey, do you want to go have a beer? I'm like, fuck it. Yeah, let's go. I, Red flag. People who know me. Exactly. I do not random people on the street that I just you don't even drink no I drink but not a lot I drink maybe once every you know every when a fan asks you we go to a bar here's what I know of the guy the guy he makes ice cream he's an ice cream man (laughs) and he was hanging out with a guy yeah he makes ice cream so we was that Alessandro (laughs) ice cream man yeah he makes ice cream okay I'm liking this guy we sit down we start talking (laughs) turns out ice cream it's just like a... He screams. He, he, it's, just, <laughs> it's just a hobby of his. Listen to this. He's a Nepo baby. His father is a shipping magnet. He's a billionaire. And he just oh. wanted to be an ice cream man? I love this guy. It's his hobby. I, I thought he made... He's like, oh, I yeah. have a shop that made ice cream, but now I'm doing sausages or whatever. <laughs> he just, he just he has fun. He starts showing me. He's like, yeah, we're talking. He's like, yeah, I was supposed to be on Ocean Gate. You guys remember the, the, the vessel that exploded? Stop. No. That's now he's just trying to get you in his pants. At the beginning, I'm like, okay, there's this no way. This is too much. There's no That's way. So I, would pull a line. I would pull that line. I don't believe it. But the guy pulled out his phone. He shows me. He's like, oh, this is me. He loves space. He's like, oh, this is me hanging out with Buzz Aldrin. No way. And he's with Buzz Aldrin. Wow. Yeah, maybe it was just like a, a, a book signing. No, 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 no. It's and then he showed me him in the Antarctic. I'm like, oh, how did you come up with the ocean? He's like, oh, that's just CGI. I was in the Antarctic. I know you don't believe in money, but there's some rich <laughs> men out there. He's like, oh, I was in the Antarctic for I don't know how long. Okay, is he single? <laughs> I ask him, how do you deal with gold diggers? He's like, I can spot them a mile away. <laughs> okay, but true. Look, he wants to fuck him too. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the guy starts showing me. Oh, he's like, dude. He met Buzz Aldrin. He met like a. All, he met every member of okay. Apollo Eleven. Wow. Okay, that's impressive. And I ask him, I'm like, hey, how are the children of like, let's say, like those Buzz Aldrin? He's like, oh, yeah. they're all fucked up. I'm like, what and he's doing? not. He's an ice cream man. He makes. I think it was just like, oh, I'll open an ice cream store because I like ice cream. That's what rich people do. I'm really curious about this story. <laughs> yeah, sorry. <laughs> I'm blow. He's like, show me. Okay, this will impress maybe three people in the audience. So he was in an event where he met Stephen Hawking, and he shows me like him and Stephen Hawking, and Stephen like, like this. Whoa. And then he's like, oh yeah, and then they took us all, and we went to like... He, Epstein's Island. I know. <laughs> it's going next. And he didn't go to Epstein Island, but he went to the Virgin guy. What's the name of the... Richard Branson. Ri- he went oh. to the Richard Branson Whoa. Island. Virgin. Okay, I know what you're talking about. And he met like the two owners of Google. I'm telling you, Rich. This is really cool. Yeah, Don't Sergey. Sergey, and apparently... And one Larry. of them is an asshole. One of them is very cool. Yeah, yeah. I, I saw the is. social network. So anyways, so he's uh, he's showing me he's in Cambridge, okay? And then they take him to... the. Apparently, Cambridge has a library. And in the library, you have like a secret books or like special right. books. Right. It's like a dungeon. Like, And then you go to like a very specific area. And he showed me... He the Quran. Ha- not the Quran. <laughs> 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 he showed you the truth. <laughs> <laughs> he has... Isaac Newton's notebook. <laughs> Yo, that's that's pretty impressive. The hand, like, Stop it right now. <laughs> that's really Isaac cool. Newton. And you were not gay for this guy. I was you like, let a bro. bartender touch you, but this guy, you... <laughs> no. And I, by the way... You didn't want to come across like the gold digger. not gay. But, here's the funny part. When he came to the show, he came with a really hot girl. 
And I tried to hit on her in the past because I met her. Yeah, what's like, wrong with? Oh, I'm, I'm like, oh, that's if that's your type. There's no way. This would be <laughs> your type. You're like billionaires. Anyways, one of the most interesting. We sat in a shitty bar, just him and I, and like some guy. And we start talking. Most interesting human I ever met. Wow. And this is what I know because we start talking. A rich drinking. man, most interesting human. No, but he is interesting. That is interesting. And because he's not, he wasn't impressing me like, oh, this is my car. This is my Patek Philippe. No, he's like, look, it's. Uh, he's uh, impressing you with his mind. This is Darwin's notebook. Like he showed me wow. a photo of him like eh, with Darwin's notebook. But handwriting. These guys, can you guess how is their handwriting? Isaac Newton and Darwin. Shit. Shit. Okay, you say shit. What do you guys think? It's gorgeous handwriting. It's the most beautiful hand, all written with the plume, like, you know, with mm. the... Oh, calligraphy. I'm like, oh my God. And look at my jokes, like, just jizz, yeah, jizz, yeah. jizz, 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 jizz. I'm like, I need... It's not even notes. It's literally, I've seen it. It's just dick pics. It just, it's just like, hand-drawn <laughs> drawn dicks. dicks. And I then I'm pretend I don't genius. know this man. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. Did you show him? No. <laughs> Why yeah, not? Him. You're like, you can now say you met Amr. <laughs> I, I in your adventure, like, one day you'll be able super friendly guy. So, anyways, uh, we we start drinking, we're doing shots, we're having beer, and then you know when you drink, you start we start talking about like girlfriends mm-hmm. and love, and uh, he's telling the me like cop. what's going on in his life, and you know what I noticed and I realized, feelings there's no like feelings are free. You don't need money to have feelings. Yeah, like, wow. Joy and sadness. He like the sadness he felt after a breakup. I'm like, oh, I. I felt that. Mm-hmm. So it's just, it, the, he just gets to experience, like, because he's going to the moon, not the moon. Like, you know, like that. He can just have escapism. He can escape his feelings in a different way, but the yeah. feeling is there. The feeling, the, like, oh, he, t- he was telling me, as I said, he was supposed to go on Ocean Gate, mm-hmm. but he didn't go because of COVID. But then his friend went. He said, yeah, my friend went, and then he died. He told me, like, oh, Whoa. my friend, I don't know what the hell his name is, he died in the explosion in Ocean Gate. And then you were making jokes about and it. I'm like, oh my God. For like three months, I was just I was like, look, these fucking losers. I know, right? Yeah, yeah. And now the guy was like telling me, oh, my friend, I had like tears. That's like finding out like Gabe died in a Bixie accident. That's yeah. like how, that's like, like the poor edition. <laughs> it is. The poor people's edition. They're not improv. You know what I mean? Gabe. He, like, he had tears in his face. It's like, like Gabe got murdered by French Canadians. <laughs> 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 They'd be like, he was right to be scared. I know. I was justified. It was it was a glory glorified death. I was like, yes, I knew I was right. Ah, a martyr. <laughs> yeah, I was a martyr. I was like I was like Che Guevara. <laughs> yeah. So, anyways, uh, we keep drinking. The bar closes. We're like, he's like, we're both drunk. I'm like, dude, you can't drive. Let's walk. He he parked the park. I'm like, let's walk. Wait, car. did he take? Did he pick up the bill? Uh, I, I Good question. The first time, I'm like, guys, it's on me. Because again, uh-huh. in my mind, oh, you're the you're ice like- cream man. <laughs> <laughs> I'll pay. <laughs> I'll pay the first bill. <laughs> yeah. And then he's like, okay, the next round is on me. Then he paid the next round. And then he Did he like- take you to like France, you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this whole thing happened in France. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, it, I was, and then we we're talking and then he was telling me because he, he's Middle Eastern, he's Lebanese. And uh, he was telling me like uh, most of his fortune is in a Lebanese bank. Oh, so he's no longer rich. Right now, the banks, you can't pull money out of mm. uh, banks in Lebanon. So he's telling me like, he was telling me about his problems with his bills. <laughs> I'm like, oh, you know, you might have went to Antarctica and then went into I mean, zero gravity. You've never been poor. <laughs> That's yeah. an experience you can't afford. <laughs> oh, wow. You're yeah, right. you he, can't he, cosplay he that. Know. Yeah, yeah, you can't, yeah like, it's, oh, a, it's a different it. struggle. I'll, you can't exactly. fake that shit. Oh. Yeah, I'll eat a can of cured meat. You or should do yeah, it. or freaking out. Like, what am I going to do tonight, you know? So crazy. He called someone in Lebanon. We're drunk. We're walking on, like, Jean Talon. At three thirty in the morning, like uh, he's like, wait. I'll... And what time did the night start? Uh, like went, eight p.m. I went, no, I went for a walk at midnight, so I guess he interrupted oh. me at midnight. And then Just he... picking up random That's men. That's so cool. It's, it that. was. That's a good story. He, he Are you still friends? Yeah, I have his phone number. But he lives in Montreal, or yeah. he's like yeah, yeah, he in, in South America yeah, or something. Yeah. What's? Yeah, get him on the phone. Yeah, prove you know it. I'll, I'll, I'll ask him to send me photos of Isaac Newton's... <laughs> yeah. Dildo. Or whatever. If there's no pics, we don't believe it. It's, the guy is, I think, 300... You know Virgin Interactive? What's it called? Virgin Atlantic? What's it called? Oh, what's it called? 
Fortune 500? No, the Fortune 500. <laughs> I'm just saying That's, rich things. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, what are we saying? The Forbes? Uh, if you want to be a space... Bill O'Reilly. Virgin Intergalactic. Yeah, uh, Intergalactic. So I, see, like I saw three, that sci-fi. He's like 300 on the... the oh, so he's going to go up into... He's, gonna he's go, actually yeah. going to go into space. Okay. Yeah. So Dude, he's he met <laughs> his friends that he was supposed oh, to go to Ocean Gate with in the Antarctic. You understand? Wow. Rich. Yeah. How rich you have to be to, to hang out with Buzz. You know, at at two, event? you know, two of them that were in the Ocean Gate were Pakistani. Yeah, one and of them, I know them. One of them is a friend of. Uh, I know, I know one of them. Okay, so my friend that I grew up with is related to them. Oh, now we know. Now everybody knows this fucking guy. <laughs> now we're okay. all rich. Now now we all know Ocean Gate, guy, right? We now all, everybody knows this fucking guy. You think guy. Amher's special? <laughs> okay, I grew up with a girl, and uh, it's like her second cousin or something. He's Pakistani and his kid's like half Pakistani. Yeah. And that kid did not want to go. Oh, thank God. No, he, he oh, died. He went. He went oh. But he did not want to go. That was the craziest part. And the father. He offended. He's like. <laughs> <laughs> the oh, father. Yeah, on. the father like was like, no, it's going to be an amazing adventure. Na, 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 na. And it's an event. It's What's the last the adventure they ever had. I don't know. Anyway, so that's. Rich guy, Pakistani. <laughs> so that guy. It's so crazy. Like you realize every joke is punching down. Because for him? No, not for him. As a comedian, I make jokes about everybody, right? So when I make jokes about those billionaires, I'm like, oh, they're just billionaires. But I'm like, that's someone's friend. That's someone's brother. So he's like... Wow, you you're proving to, you really have a heart. So you just... Exactly. You just have to accept... No, no, I'll continue making... I just have to accept the fact that every joke... Well, it depends. If you're it. actually making fun of the person or making fun of a, a bad decision no, they no, made. No, the person. You know me. I don't give a shit. Yeah, we like, know. Like, ha ha, you're dead. But at the same yeah, time, you did that about uh, your best friend Gabe after you cried your love for him. Yeah, I'm gonna pee on his grave. <laughs> wow, no. And then gonna go pew 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 pew. Wait, what? And then Gabe's gonna go <laughs> yeah, from the grave. There's <laughs> gonna be a ball of his hair coming out. <laughs> It's it's right. like a ball of his hair coming it's a out. Ball of hair. Yeah, here it goes. It's like a ball of hair. Show no. Tumbleweed. <laughs> Oh my god. So yeah, that was <laughs> That is a pretty crazy. That's a pretty fun story. And I, when did this I happen? Did is I, I said yes. I yes ended life. I yeah. know. Isn't it, those are the best moments. That's the best. So guys, yes and life. Yeah, you it know, is fun. You might lose a kidney or you might meet a really cool guy. <laughs> nice. That that's awesome. That is that is a good story. I yes ended this moment and do yeah. I regret it? <laughs> yes. <laughs> No, I, yeah, I yes, and, I yes, and all the time. Yeah. And I'll tie it back together. So when I was in up in the French world, <laughs> <laughs> or whatever it was called, at a certain point, I had acceptance in my heart. I was like, these people aren't trying to kill me. <laughs> They're actually kind of nice. And the line dancers, they all went to bed. I'm like, thank God. And then the normal French people came out. We all started dancing. And there was the band, right? And the guitars was unreal. They were playing like Guns N' Roses. There was oh, like there was like a guitar solo. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> and I was dancing my I was dancing pretty good. You know, I I went to, to the to, to the bar and I bought a beer. They have moles in there too, you know. Of course. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And uh, and it was a good night, yeah. And then uh, I woke up the next day, I was like, I don't know what the fuck was up with me at all. And then we went home, and then that's it. And I and I love French people now. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> I yes and it in the end. <laughs> oh, nice. You faced your fears. <laughs> I'm still scared. Just normal French Canadians. <laughs> what a fear. All right, let's see what I wrote down here. Oh, yes. Yeah, okay, let's see. Ooh. No, I just took notes. In your Isaac Newton oh. handwriting. <laughs> Everybody's... <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, 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 some dicks. <laughs> That's, That's why he can't write it properly. <laughs> he writes with his dick. Okay, well, uh, we usually talk about like doing shows and like things we do. You guys wanna wanna hear about like comedy shows? No, they comedy, don't want to hear about that. Comedy like science? Mm, no. Uh, comedy science? Yeah. I don't even know. <laughs> okay, Teach me. Sure. Because okay, so uh, I did a I did a show in a park <laughs> in front of like hundred and fifty oh, people. Yeah, okay. the park show is sick, eh? What park? Uh, Giroir. You know the oh. Zach so Kick show? Zach Kick has There's 150 show. people there? It was, Usually, it was yeah. insane. That's amazing. Yeah. yeah. So it was a park and I, I went last, so there was no more light. So I had to make people laugh in total darkness. Mm. Dude. Oh. And I'm like, oh, all I have are my jokes mm. and my body. Because it's like a shadow. And I'm like, 
Yeah, the there's nothing there. You're pitch black. Really? So you were like an offensive clown. <laughs> I was an offensive <laughs> clown. And I learned so much. I really like jokes. There's two types of jokes, right? Jokes, some people just say words, and the words are funny, and you get people to laugh. And people would laugh at that. Or like I say, you're physical, and you do. Mm -hmm. And then you get people, like you do sounds, and mm -hmm. then people laugh. Or you do. I have jokes where you need to see. Like I have a joke where I say my mom loves African cocks. But it's a joke. It's not working well <laughs> yeah. in this room. No, but you have to, like, when I do it, you have to look at my face like, oh, it's a joke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But they didn't see that. <laughs> so they just said, oh, I guess his mom likes African cocks. So they're like, please tell us more. Like, there's no, like, <laughs> they, they couldn't see the, you know, the yeah. metaphorical the wink. wink. Yeah. Uh, so they're like, okay, so <laughs> African cock. There was a very, very like, I had to be, like, bigger. It was so interesting. I felt like I was doing an arena. Honestly, guys, if you ever... You should do shows in front of 150 people, right? Riley? <laughs> in a park. In the you park. should yes and that moment. <laughs> yeah. So let's see here. Oh, big news. Uh, let's talk about this. As you guys know, there was an attempt. Oh, yeah. Trump. Oh, yeah. Ouch. Yeah. So, Ouch. Gabe, how did you get away with it? No. <laughs> <laughs> pew, pew. <laughs> no, it's funny. We were in the, so me and Claire, we were in the forest when it happened, right? And Claire was like reading it to me. Like she, because I, I didn't have my phone on me. And so Claire was like, oh, there was an assassination attempt on the president. And I was like, oh, really? And then and I was like, like, but I was like, really? Like, because it didn't really make sense. But he's not the president. Or, yeah. Or, <laughs> Claire, he is. Claire, wow, like, we... not my president. Damn. Damn. Little subliminal. Damn, I'm, just, I'm, I'm projecting, I guess. <laughs> but, uh, and, but I was like, really? Like, and then she was like, oh, actually, I don't know. Maybe metaphorically there was an attempt of assassination on him. And I was like, huh? And then I didn't think about it till the next day. Then I found it the next day. Yeah, I was like, whoa. You know what? Honestly, I was very underwhelmed by the whole incident. Like, really? Really? I don't know why. I feel like it's just been so insane in the news in the last, like, year that it just was like, what? yeah. Yeah, America. what else? It's America. Yeah, he's, what do we expect? He's going like, to win. Yeah, no, yeah. but the thing is, he's a hero. Oh, yeah. But I do believe <laughs> this. A hero. No, but I do he's believe this hero. guy. Whether, no, no, no. But the, he is the he, luckiest man in the world. It's insane. This guy, I already I thought know. he was the luckiest man in the world when he wasn't getting charged. Yeah. But this, I'm like, you're, you're just. He's. You know what is gonna happen? This is my prediction. He's gonna turn into a prophet. That's the 100%, next step. Yeah. They're all going to, the the like the right wing, the his yeah. super fans, they're going to consider him a prophet and he's going to lean into it. Yeah. He's going to be the first prophet president. He's the return of Jesus. He is. He's is, the Messiah. Isn't in Christianity, Jesus. Or the Antichrist. Again? No, I think, I think, I swear to you, I think they're going to turn this guy into a prophet. Not that <laughs> Mark my words. Are Who's, you guys pro or anti Trump? <laughs> <laughs> Pro Trump. All right. Wow. The only he doesn't immigrant. like your people. <laughs> the only immigrant in the room is like, yeah, yeah. yeah, I love Trump. Look at the white people. You know, all of them are voting for Trump. They just they can't say it out loud. Yeah. yeah. And she's closeted going to like vote for the other guy. No, but I mean, like, listen, Biden's atrocious. He did you? I just kept watching the video. You know what I always thought was more shocking? Him calling Zelensky Putin. Yeah, and I watched that on repeat. Like, <laughs> I'm, like I watched that more than I watched the shooting. I was like, yeah, yeah, a shooting. Let's but explain. Let's explain. So Zelensky was meeting with Putin and other people. Uh, no, it wasn't meeting with Putin. Zelensky <laughs> was. Let's start again. Are you okay? Oh, yeah, but, uh, oh no! Ow, my ear. Yeah. Get my ear pierced. No, <laughs> Biden was meeting with Zelensky and a bunch of other people, and Biden was like, "Huh, there's the president of the president of Ukraine, Vladimir Putin." The, yeah, yeah. Vladimir Putin. He's gonna beat Vladimir Putin. And then he shot yeah. his pants or something. But yeah, sad. This shitty imitation is as good as Joe Biden was. Like, yeah. no, his yeah. delivery was actually worse. Uh, you know what I mean? Like, no, it, it's so bad. And then he also. Call like Kamala Harris uh, Trump's VP. Like he's like, it's yeah, bad. Really it's bad. really bad. So it's like, it's just a joke now. Uh, yeah. Did you see uh, Tenacious D is getting mm -hmm. canceled? Yeah. Because he made a really, uh, like a nothing joke. Like, I, I don't know. He was on stage with someone and he just said something about like, if it was Trump, I wouldn't have missed. Like, I think he was hitting the guy and he missed him. And he's like, well, if you were Trump, I wouldn't have missed you. And now he's getting canceled. Oh. <laughs> no, but it's like, <laughs> he just got to go on the profit train and he'll be fine. Okay. Well, listen, 
Yeah, listen, we, we have like I said, Trudeau. I don't have any opinions. We but... have Trudeau, guys. Did you hear Trudeau also? Because we still have Trudeau. Okay, is what a, you should there's say. There's a theory. <laughs> we there, still have him. There's a theory that's saying that the whole shooting was just a way for Trump to gather support from his like his people. Did you guys know this? Did you guys hear this? I have a theory that next, like Trudeau. It's gonna be like, oh my god, but like the liberal version. So Trudeau is gonna be like, glitter oh bomb. God. No, no, someone misgendered me at a rally. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I need support from everybody. All right. Sorry, Stephanie. He's just gonna do a live conversion no. to Islam. That's a tweet. This is, I should have kept it as a tweet. <laughs> no, I, they can't all be hits. It's fine. Uh, wanna, play that, wanna play that game we were saying? We yes. Yeah, that game you mentioned. Uh, how long have we been recording? About, uh, we're at 8, 8, 808 now, I think. 809. 8.08. So we are, Coming. I think we're about 55 minutes. 55 minutes? Because I think we started a little late after okay. 7. So, uh, guys, we have here someone who wants to be a therapist. No, I never said that. <clears throat> She's good at it. Thank yeah, you. do you like my questions? So we're going we're gonna to open here. If you guys had any troubles in your relationships or in your <laughs> lives. I want Claire, to do not say a word. <laughs> Don't do a bootleg version of I my show. To write a, maybe, Joel, can you rip some papers? And ha- oh, fuck, we no, no, one someone pen. has to be live. Yeah. Oh, who's anyone has a question or? I feel like she has a question. You, you have think? a question. Yes. Oh, yeah. yes. 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 So uh, I was supposed to get together with someone okay. during the beginning of the summer. And then he decided to get a girlfriend. Bitch. <laughs> Even though we had talked about plans of like living the rest of our days out together. Oh. Didn't happen. Wait, you discuss about living the rest of your lives together. Well, I told him I'm in it to win it. Yeah. I was like, I'm in it with you. Okay. And did you guys meet at this point? We were friends for like months and months. And you would see each other all the time. We still see each other. I work with him. Oh. Using a hammer. Using a Using hammer. a hammer. So you need to wash your clothes thoroughly. <laughs> Unlike us. <laughs> okay, okay, no, hold up. So you ended up... Okay, so this person was gassing you up and being like getting you to open up be vulnerable talk about your lives together and then when does he meet this girl like two weeks after i said okay i'm ready to start dating but what happened in those two weeks he got a girlfriend girlfriend or like he started hooking up with a girl and then she became a girlfriend i think he was hooking up with her before that's which is okay which is okay right yeah i mean i was hooking up with other people we were like we'll do our own things for the winter yeah but you didn't want it was like uh you know have you ever expressed this to him that you're like like what the hell bro yeah we've talked about it because we're still friends to this day so why are we friends that's a good question why are we friends well is he He's not a bad guy. He's, He's not a to bad guy. Yeah, yeah. He's yeah. allowed. Okay. The hard wants what the hard wants. On like the friendship scale, because we were friends for quite a long time before I was like, hey, how about. Okay, wait, hold up. So, what is the question? <laughs> wait, what? What is the question? Wait, what is the question? Where can we find some dick? dick Where can we find some dick? Let's get it started, started in here. Okay, but hold on. Why did we have How's to know dick? about the whole backstory? Yom is married. Hey, you guy. I don't know. You sir with a little hat. Hi. You want gua- Hi. no, but you want dick or you want quality dick? I want quality dick. You that's you're not gonna find sir, that. How no, no, you're just not gonna find it. I'm sorry. He, we don't know this man. He's sitting in the back. Hello, sir. How's your dick? Is it quality? Is it top grade? Let's let the man talk here. How's your dick, sir? You have to ask people who I'm, I'm, I'm not an object. Ooh. It's a European dick. <laughs> a little, little different. Uh, little it's a no. Oh. It's a no. Listen. <laughs> he, he was like... <laughs> All right, the she's thing a lesbian. Is, All right, let's no, find no. her girl now. <laughs> no, it's the thing. You're not going to find quality dick. Sorry. Listen, she <laughs> is dead on the inside. Do not think this I'm way. I'm on the outside. Be, keep your heart open. You never know. Sorry. You never know. You never know. Well, no, I, but okay, no, she. No, I feel like everything's gonna be fine. Yeah, it happens. That's what happens. That's the problem I find with in modern. But things. do you? Like, f- yeah. But Heart, the whole, what, people, I've been in a relationship like, okay, I'm gonna fuck, you're gonna fuck, and then when we're ready, we get together. But you, when you make love or you fuck someone, you might end up having feelings with that person. It's a very, it's a bonding experience. So maybe he. That's what happens. He fucked someone. Here's what I think. I don't think he was fucking a lot of people in the meantime. <laughs> I think. Amar knows this guy. <laughs> Sorry? No, what I'm saying is that it will happen. 
when this situation we say like, okay, I fuck people and you fuck people, and then maybe later when we're both ready, we get together. Things like this might happen. You heal the one of the people will have sex with someone else, and then feelings will get attached if you have sex more than one time. But sometimes, yeah. are, just like your therapist, he's dead to me. He's dead to you. Yeah. yeah, but that's it. That's the thing. But the thing is, at the same time, too, you can have a deep love for someone without, like, it being that. So, like, maybe right now it's really fresh and it's not cool that he did that. And I think the fact that you got that out is a good thing. But so you have to take solace in that. But, yeah, like, you know, at the end of the day, there's nothing to be threatened by because if he could do that with you, it's like, this guy's psychotic. This guy is an open mic comedian. Wait, what? He's for he sure a comedian. Hey. Wait, He's pause, like, pause, pause. Why is he psychotic? Because, listen, how do you reveal all these feelings for someone? You're so sincere. You tell yeah. the person you want to move on. And then two weeks later, it's like, oopsie daisy, I'm in love with this completely other person. It's a bit weird. No, you're, you're, no, that's... No, that doesn't make the math isn't Wait, mapping. It wasn't a few days. The though, math isn't mapping. But that just All tells the me. All men are agreeing with me. Silently. No, but that I means. Right no, but that means. Tell. And I'm sorry to say this, but it means he wasn't that sincere. Mm -mm. It's true. It's true. Yeah, he I wasn't that true. sincere true. about it because you don't have that feeling or confess that to someone. And then in two weeks, you're Wait, like. What feelings did he confess? Good question. He said to me, I understand what you want and I agree with you and I'm all in with you. Yeah. Okay, and then he met someone. That's psycho. That's psychotic. That's psychotic. No. Yes, that's uh, not psychotic. But there's a thing between normal and psychotic. Okay, no, listen. You're with you're with your you're with what you're no, but you're with your fi fiance. When you first like knew you were in love and you wanted to be with her, yeah. could you imagine in two weeks someone could break that up? Oh no! There you go. <laughs> Thank you. And that's why he should oh, be dead definitely to you. Definitely, you should move on. I'm not saying you shouldn't move on. Definitely, 100 percent, you should move on. Okay. <laughs> I think we proved our point. I think we proved our point. Um, <laughs> no sounds coming out of Gabe. Did no Amber sounds win, coming out. Did Amber win better than your therapist? <laughs> is that how the game works? Yeah. No, but this is good. We have all different points of view. Okay. I don't think he's psychotic. I think he's human. That's what happens. Humans. I think he lied. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, my advice is that. I know women are better than men. Men were unable to be friends with someone that we liked or we are attracted to. Are you able to be friends with a guy all you men? have feelings for? No, that's not true. Yeah. Am I able to be friends with guys? You had feelings for, yeah. Yeah, I'm friends yeah. with him right now. But but you But still, she works with still, him. Yeah, that but sucks. You still hurt. Yeah, but Amr, she has no. to work with him. If someone's not interested in me, I'm like, I'm not interested in you. Oh, wow. Okay, you're able to... Yeah. Women have that superpower. I, I, don't, I don't think men have this. If I'm attracted to a girl... No, I, I, best friend, I can't. Be I don't have that. I'm like, you're I'm going to destroy... I am a dude. Yeah, yeah. But the thing is... No, the thing is, I, I don't like it, but I know that I have to move on. I don't have a choice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's there... You but you're like, okay, man. but I have to live in reality. Okay. Well, round of applause for, oh, Jack for opening up. Guys. Thank you. No, honestly, we'll thank Jack. you. That was great. You should come to my show. Damn. Better than your therapist. All right. Do we have it's any in other No, this whole situation made me very uncomfortable. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> this is really what makes me uncomfortable. Actually, yeah. Well, I don't want to know anything about it. Oh, you, anybody here. What, do you, what the fuck that was I love it. It makes me it's feel the worst anyone idea else? show Can ever. Can we keep doing this? Anyone else have a question? Oh, yeah. my God. I think we need to. I think she has show. a question. Yeah, yeah, you for sure have a question. My love life is really good, actually. Uh. Okay, it doesn't have to be about love. It could be about career. Ooh, <laughs> I'll be getting in her face. My love language. My love love is. Yeah, amazing. she's like, I'm fine. I'm great. No, but if you have any other questions, it could be about literally anything. <laughs> oh yes. Oh, oh. Do I apply for jobs in Montreal? Or out west. Out west. Once I graduate. No. Yeah, I wait, think 100% out west. Wait, wait, wait. That's the most horrible advice. Just right away without any details. First, what did you study? I'm doing my master's in art education. Art education. And they have art out west? I don't know. <laughs> Do they have a hammer out wait. west? <laughs> Do they have a hammer? So they'll give her a hammer like art. <laughs> <laughs> Painting. Cave. <laughs> You guys know what I'm talking about? <laughs> you know the cavemen, this is how they made the first paintings? This is Winnipeg, in my mind. It's just... I think Montreal is definitely a lot more interesting. So you might be yeah. more inspired here if you want to stay in the art 
area. Yeah. But if you want to make money, you definitely get the fuck out of here. Yeah, but then you gotta spend it all. Here's the thing. Here's but what you I make more money. Here's what I recommend: a build your experience here for a couple of years, so that you can ask for a higher salary when you go to the West. Because if you go as a newbie, you won't make that much money. But if you come with like with a with a nice resume, I work at these museums. I did this, this, this. You can ask literally forty thousand dollars more. When you the leave. friend is also gonna kill her if she leaves. So we, she's already murdered enough personal and friends. Has a hammer. <laughs> we established this. She you guys are best hammers. friends. Oh my god. Are you guys best friends? Oh. oh. It's the first time you bring a girl. I won't be mad. For her because I sure. Yeah. Why do you want to go to the West? Why the West? Oh, I'm from there. Oh. But you left there for a reason. To go to school here. Okay. And okay. How's, how's your life been here? I love it here. Then you stay. Stay for a couple of years. Build your yeah. resume. I'm telling you, build your resume. Yeah. And then you'll you'll you can ask for way more. You don't want to start That's true. as a beginner. Can you build speak your, French? <laughs> Wow, she's better really? than you. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. <laughs> really? Okay. She speaks English too. Oh You'll be no. Fine. Wait, how long have you been here? Uh, I was in French immersion growing up. Ah, uh, oh. that's why. Okay. You went to a public high school in Montreal. I know, but in I, French. I grew up speaking uh, Urdu. whatever. Yeah, Urdu yeah. and uh, <laughs> Greek and Hindi. You speak better than I do. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that was great. I, I hope we solved all your life advice. <laughs> You're staying here? Are oh. you wait, are you applying? I'm going to start applying once everybody's attendance. Oh. I feel like we're staying until the period is over. No, it's oh. amazing. Oh, this is very I, No, I love this. I love this. You have to understand, broken people, we love giving advice. That's yes. what happens right now. No, I love, I love <laughs> it. Just so you know, the job search is going to be painful. So get ready. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I think I actually need to start saving. Yeah, this economy, good luck. When I'm like done as a student and all the research assistant work and all the work I get through school, and then I have to like get like... What type of art do you do? Is it related to mommy issues or daddy issues? Let's just go. Hammers. <laughs> no, but she has a wrench. It's do you see that? There's a sticker hammers. with a wrench and a hand. Yeah, so that's like, from the Open Hardware Summit. The, I don't know. You're acting as if I would know. I have no idea. That Stanley bottle? Is that a... <laughs> it's from where? To say, like, her resume is so established already, and she's already... Had don't say that. That's She's ready to leave, then. <laughs> then go to New York. Go, go to New York. New York? Yeah! Yes! Trump. Trump is not in New York. Uh, I know, I know yeah. people... Wait, There's from? 400 million people. Don't worry. Yeah, you'll bump into people like that, but you'll bump, but you're bumping into them here too. You know what I mean? Like. But wait, you want to create art or study art or what do you do with art? She was okay, honestly, what I've found in my art practice is that I really like to make stuff. We're just gonna keep that really broad and vague. Hammers. Um, yeah, hammers, metal, wood, paint, media arts, sound. sculptures. Not so much installation. What? I was saying it's me. Yeah. Oh, you're an artist too. Yeah, yeah we met in art school. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, so there's that part, and then there's the um, the community practice, like working with people, teaching, the art education part, the social practice, the social justice, and then there's the new part that I like, which is research, which is like the super nerdy uh -huh. part I didn't know existed. So honestly, like those three things. If, as an artist, like where else? Montreal. You know what I'm thinking? Montreal? No, but you know what I'm thinking? We need to we get. I need. I think we need to get your Lebanese billionaire friend to fund these two, mm. so they can stay here, and then you can work on your projects. You know, forget this Lebanese guy doing ice cream. He should support us poor artists and let us continue doing our work. We don't have. I think that's a good idea. Better than your therapist. Get him on the phone. I'm so happy I didn't invite him to <laughs> Build me a set. I'll do live visuals in the background. This is amazing. Record your sound. And we'll bring him to invest. And we'll mix the sounds in live because we don't need you. We just need the sound. We just need a billionaire. Yeah. Social justice. <laughs> LGBTQ. Except if he's Listen, a billionaire. Listen, you don't. Accept him fully ka -ching, ka -ching. But you have to remember. LGBTQ ka -ching. This but is you have No, but you have to remember. This you don't like earn a billion dollars. You steal a billion dollars. So right, we guys, don't. Oh. This is the podcast. Yeah. I want to. Uh, Joel.
Can you get the sweets? Let's get the sweets right now. Cannolis. Let's get yeah. some. Yes. yes. Guys. Baby. Did you guys have fun? Yeah. You guys were great. You guys were great. Thank no, you. you guys were great. So much. Here's what we're going to do, guys. Now, we're going to eat some delicious cannolis. Uh, and then after the cannolis, uh, we have a show, a comedy show. Stand up. Stand up comedy show. And you guys are all welcome to stay. Mm -hmm. uh, starting at like 8 30, 8 45. So, uh, yeah, let's fucking eat some. Dad! By the chef right here, right here. Got Thank Alessandro. you, Alessandro. <laughs> Alessandro. Jules. Joe, come on Joe. in, guys. All right, uh, well. <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, what Open can you do? it up. <laughs> uh, Thomas, can you put on some music? Or you, Joel, can you go play some music? So, guys, thank you so much. You guys have been amazing. Yeah, you guys have been great. We thank love you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.